Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. Kola Edokpa the human rights activist we did for Benin City for Edo State. Don't call on President Tinubu make a joint protest where it won't happen on the 1st of August. Make I leave you, make you hear from Kola Edokpa Ye. Kola Edokpa Ye, good afternoon. Uh, we want to know your take on, on the upcoming uh, August 1st nationwide protest. Yes, as we are fully aware that uh, August 1st 2024, the oil polloi, the raptors and the bobtis, the hibilis and the hobos, the plebeian, the dark trodden, the ewers of food and the freshers of water of Nigeria economy, and the talakawas are coming out to say Kabudo Rejectamenta to the high level of abject penury, high level of uh, corruption, the state of economic disequilibrium, the state of political quagmire in our country. You know, sovereignty resides in the people. Any government that try to jettison the people cannot exist in a democratic system of government. The level of hunger, the level of frustration is extremely unprecedented in Nigeria. To the extent that some people do visit the dustbin of the rich to get something to eat, it is as bad as that in our country. Shall we continue to be mute that the grace may abound? God, God, God forbid, Nigeria belongs to all of us. Nigeria is not specifically for the, the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Nigeria belongs to you and me. It would be sardonic if we decided to maintain great silence in the midst of hunger, in the midst of economic retrogression, in the midst of economic quagmire. You are fully aware that the masses are always peaceful when coming out to protest, to vet their frustration, to vet their anger. They are without guns, they are without bullets, they are without ammo attack. They are only they are always hung with their with their placards saying enough is enough, saying we cannot continue like this. And it was the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Senator Bola Ahmed Tinibu, the, 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 the Jagaban that is beating the total of Jagajaga -Jaga in the country, that taught us how to protest. He taught us how to protest. He protested against the removal of West subsidy in 2012 by then President Good Luck. Ebele, Azikiwe, Jonathan. Our president has also gone to the barricades with the lack of Afre Rewane, Olisa Agbakoba, Bamidele Aturu, Chilgani Fawemi, Femi Falana. And others who fought for the enthronement of democracy in Nigeria. We have we are we are, we are perplexed and flabbergasted that our president, who is one of the heroes of Nigeria democracy, has meandered. 
and is trying to activate security agencies to stop peaceful protesters from protesting or from exercising their right to freedom of association and peaceful assembly and their right to freedom of movement. The constitution is supreme. Section 1, section 1, section 1, section 3 of the 1999 constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria demystify the supremacy of the constitution. I want to submit precisely and laconically that this administration has pushed the masses to the war and the masses are now fighting peacefully to make to ensure that the right thing is done. Since the removal of forest subsidy, the the situation the uh, 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 as a, uh, the situation of the masses became extremely exacerbated beyond redemption and you want them to be mute I want to advise the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria as a no protester to lead the, the protest to join the masses to join the hungry masses on August 1st to protest against its economic policies that are sequestered and sequestrate the whole polloi to the dustbin of history. We cannot continue like this. The, the protest is going to be peaceful. You know, whenever the masses are, are gathering, or whenever the masses gather, whether in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, whether in Johannesburg, South Africa, whether in Nigeria, whether in Nairobi, Kenya, the cry is always, we need freedom, we need justice, let the right thing be done. The President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria needs to attend, to give attention to the cries of the people, because the people are gnashing their teeth in pains, they are crying. They are ululating on daily on daily basis. Instead of trying to, to, to infringe on the rights of the people, let him address the cries of the people. The people are crying for the wind of change. The wind of positive change is blowing across Africa. The Kenya, Kenya the people of Kenya forced their president to jettison anti-people policy. I know that these protests will make the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria jettison anti-people policy that has emasculated the people. The police, the soldiers go to the same market with us. How much is minimum wage? The minimum, minimum wage, the take home cannot even take them home. They are not happy with the system. President Bola Ahmed Tinibu Nito. Now we don't hear from Kola Edokbayi. Let us know what you think for comment section. If you never subscribe to Dan ARG YouTube, try make you subscribe so that make you for the hear all the things where they happen for Nigeria. Make I leave you with this video. Make you help us share them. Thank you for watching Dan ARG YouTube.